How are you, Partha? Fine. Okay. You know you? I'm very fine. What about uh, Manjur? How you perceive him? Uh, you have asked a very difficult question for me. How I perceive Manjur? First thing which comes to my mind is that he is a great friend. And uh, that friend who really um, vibes with me, um, he understands what is inside me, what I want and surprisingly he brings out more than really I want from me. Second thing is also I have seen him as an activist. I have seen him as an activist and uh, I have seen him as a very compassionate person having a lot of concern for the society, the statutes of the society and it is a very creative way. He basically pursues through those issues, issues which are underneath, brings out those issues after the issues start becoming visible, involves other people in experiencing, feeling and doing something for those issues. That is another part. And uh, the third dimension of his personality, I have seen him as a dramatist as a theatre person who can instantly, without much preparation, you know, bring out the best from other people. So, these are the three dimensions on which I have experienced him. Uh, I hear about him, I know about him. He is a great, probably, team builder also, because persons from many facets of life, they feel proud in working with him. As a profession you have combined and described Manju. Would you like to say where he is taking his own way, where you will see him after 10 years from now? You ask very, very <laughs> difficult questions from me. But instantly, uh, the picture emerges in my mind is that he is an international, I see him as an international change maker uh, in less than 10 years. Can you just elaborate what you mean by international change? International change maker means uh, uh, boundaries basically and boundaries of his uh, influence or his influence circle that way, I find uh, very fastly that circle is uh, enlarging itself. Uh, you remember uh, uh, we saw him in 93-94 uh, where he was and where he was in 98 when I invited him to this institute. Uh, for uh, you know uh, doing some... Uh, Which institute you are at? Uh, uh, I mean uh, Shiman Resource Development Institute of Bharat Heavy Electricals. And there he had come uh, for a two days intervention with very senior managers in the strategic management program, two weeks strategic management program, hardcore professionals having 25 years or more experience. And where he was there, and now uh, in 2006, where is he? Uh, uh, this space is a really uh, very fast pace and people who don't know him thoroughly very difficult for them to comprehend. So after 10 years I find that these boundaries are going to expand like anything and uh, basically through his combination of uh, his uh, you know deep understanding of uh, human processes and a theatre personality and activist Basically, I find immense possibilities 
as a change maker in different parts of the life. Uh, today itself, uh, I have shared you a few minutes ago that how uh, these young budding managers, engineers who were just so much constrained, all their creativity was uh, dormant inside them and how with an intervention of two hours, how this dramatic change was uh, visible in them. I have seen them really uh, experiencing life. I was really worried to see them that how at this age of 23, 24 years they have become like that. So this is just a micro experience but if I am enlarging it and putting it as a span of uh, 10 years, I, I see him uh, like that. Partha, if I uh, say you have been, uh, you have three decades uh, managerial experience, leading leader, you have been part of the several organizations in one way or other way. What five uh, areas which you see that this Manjul has to work? Has to work means in future. future. <laughs> Simple question. So he consolidate his past and boom in future. This is what is what I am trying to say. Yeah, now when he consolidate, mm. what is saying? Let yeah. me uh, help you in this. If this country takes his theater as a tool in managerial skills, how to? Means how to consolidate? How to publicize everywhere? Training is now from classroom to outbound and outbound to theatre. This is the journey which I am seeing, how you react. It is the one area which I am seeing, you have a different area. Well, this time you see, instead of working on uh, which are some of the areas in which he can uh, consolidate. So one area immediately I can say uh, that is uh, our area, our area means uh, this managerial world. And uh, based on his experiences of a few, um, a few uh, interventions in my organization particularly, uh, I find that uh, this, is, this is one area where he can put in more uh, concerted efforts, means deploy his resources and work on. The greatest thing is in this area, in this managerial area today, is the mask which everybody wears. And uh, particularly I have seen his skill uh, in uh, voluntarily unmasking the people. Whether they are doctors or whether they are scientists who were working in my our uh, R&D institute. Hardcore people and how they have unmasked themselves and then start coming across to each other and coming across to others as a human being. Basically that is a great area that is badly uh, required here, um, not only with uh, BHEL and uh, similar organizations, rather the entire industry. The second aspect is that uh, bringing out basically the um, unleashing the hidden potential of people. Large amount of creativity and uh, excellence, uh, this zeal to excel, uh, human values, particularly these three things I can say. Those things have gone, somewhere those things have become dormant inside um, the uh, managers and how in a very spontaneous and easy manner that comes out and the person is able to give his best. The person's best is not only he is able to give his best, it is perceived, it is seen, it is observed, it is evaluated by others also. Uh, that, is a, uh, that is a great area to work for. So in the management development programs, structured management development programs or even uh, semi-structured uh, meetings and all, we find there is a great potential and uh, Manjil will be able to make a major breakthrough in this area if he spends some time in this area. I see him uh, an individualistic and uh, proving himself and his, uh, how he will grow from this to a mutual individualistic or collective energy. He has a lot of energy. How he will bring many organizations under 
his uh, way of thinking is it possible for him or uh, what you see is don't you agree or disagree with me i am and just wondering and yes uh, times it appears that uh, he is self centered or basically he wants to project himself or his achievements uh it appears sometimes i also find it but the other side is also that when i want to look into the achievements or the output of his efforts which is trying to um show or publicize i find that i am able to know about those things only because he is he is doing that otherwise i would have not myself known about that when he see uh, his pictures colored pictures in the uh, you know uh, delhi national delhi and newspapers of germany and other places and then i can believe that okay he is not here he is uh, he has risen he has uh, risen uh, to heights uh, so it is there but he has to be cautious because this type of efforts may also invite uh, envious Uh, people, or in why in in those people who are either working with him or who are willing to collaborate with him, he has to be a little cautious and concerned uh, with the effect of this. Uh, otherwise, uh, I find that uh, whenever people invite for some other issues and all, at that time I don't find that he is self-centered. Rather, he focuses on the need of the other people who are calling him. Uh, he is an island in him. So and pick up those institutions who are working in the same area or something. Like, let me give you an example of uh, even managerial. How he has to collaborate with the traditional managerial approach to a new approach which he is visualizing, like a theater of relevance. Next is uh, let me share with his own experience on uh, child rights issue, child uh, protection, and uh, corporate social responsibility. He is alone uh, uh, working on this area. How you have uh, worked with organizations? You have done lot of work on organizational building. What uh, Manjul and Manjul uh, organization has to uh, work closely. to achieve uh, global issues children's uh, work uh, child labor child rights which is burning issues of the present situation how you see that this person leads from the front with all other activities what qualities he has to do or what uh, which he is doing mostly in gross with his own development and his own organization what kind of work he has to develop so that uh, not at the cost of his own uh, uh, contribution as creativity and his own contribution to his own organization he, he takes uh, uh, of course uh, again this problem is also this uh, issue also which you have shared just now this concern also is very heavily loaded i will say uh, one thing is that um, how to create many manjus true um he has to uh, think in this term now because all his past pursuits basically uh, as i see uh, has have helped him to reach a place from where uh, he can be heard by others where he is able to invite the attention of other persons i think he has reached that stage already now question is that how to uh, groom how to identify groom and develop those people who can be uh, who can stand very close to him and uh, this uh, he has to think that what type of people he needs and how those people can share his vision and his dream and can uh, you know align themselves along with him second issue is about uh, uh, developing uh, 
relationships with other organizations which pe popularly people say uh, networking and uh, with this uh, potential which he is having uh, i think he can give more attention to networking with uh, different uh, organizations training institutes or business organizations or even uh, educational organizations social organizations like that uh, because uh, these are the organizations which need him uh, much more than uh, theater and uh, what you told just now his uh, concept of theater of relevance basically keeping theater in his core he can intervene into all these areas only thing is that is some time and some sharing of his own experiences with different people different organizations and coming out to experiment in yet new areas for example creativity is one area in any uh, business organization or industrial organization like ours uh, today creativity basically lot of interventions by way of training creativity techniques dream workshops and uh, creative problem solving all these things are being done but i find that the type of potential or the type of theater uh, you know technology or methodology i can say you know uh, he can use and he can unleash that creativity in a very short time as i have seen here with very matured managers as well as his very okay, fresh partha what is your genius. own personal contribution in manjul's development this i think uh, manjul himself can say but what i find that during his formative years as a trainer i have little contribution uh, are you not a more modest basically in the process uh, process uh, process skills and later on later on i can only say that i have i had tried to bring him to the industry from that area and that to not in a very um, that to with very senior people and very mature people and very meaningful programs okay partha what is uh, manjul's contribution in your profession my profession my organization what do you mean my profession or my organization you and your profession in my profession i can say uh, the profession of trainers it has it has shown new avenues new interventions new methodologies for uh, developing people uh, my organization i can say uh, same contribution different units of bhl have taken that another contribution is that coming out from the set things uh just you heard few minutes ago that how much my friends my senior colleagues were worried that how to put few days of his methodology in the training program of engineer trainees this itself is talking that uh much contribution has been made and there is a scope of much contribution in, in different areas particularly i find that in the area of problem solving also not only creativity in the area of problem solving in the area of leadership if you say the first intervention which we made here and a great contribution it has made that is that uh, leadership focusing on leadership you know after that program uh, what uh, you from your background and manjul's background if we join both what mm -hmm. will happen what will be the outcome manjul mm -hmm. plus partha what will be the result or result will be this uh, process of by association is going to create wonders some explosion like atom bomb or something like that that is going to happen thank you bhatra for uh, exploring and sitting on the atom bomb <laughs> thanks for coming here <laughs> and relieving me and making me <laughs> speak and now thanks for relieving me finally and i thank you for formulating this heavily loaded and uh, simple or complex questions
जरा यहाँ देखिए ये तो कब्जा कर लिया मेरे को <laughs> इसीलिए तो मिल हुआ ग्रेट What is what is your message to the country? खुश रहो अल्लाह चमन हम तो सफर करते हैं ज़्यादा भी मरने हैं से we will together to fight the national issues like child labour and building a process trainer in the country as long as we live and to the country. तो मुस्कुराने पर क्या वो लग गया टैक्स लग गया क्या दोनों का सुजल कैसे करता है जॉनी जॉनी एस पाप कैसे करता है जॉनी जॉनी एस पापा जॉनी जॉनी यस पापा एटिंग शुगर टेलिंग लाइफ नहीं नहीं पहले कर गया की की में में जाके जाके बैठो बैठो तो तो और बोलो 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 क्या क्या कर रहे हो बताओ अरे वेरी गुड हंस के बताओ दद्दू अरे वेरी गुड सुजल ए सुजल बोलो दद्दू हंस के बताओ आप क्या कर रहे हैं पहले हंस के बताओ ए सुजल के अंकल आप क्या कर रहे हैं आपका फोटो निकाल लो बेटा फोटो निकाल बोल हा 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 इधर आओ देखो खत्म कर दिया वीकनेस दबा दिया हमने हाँ बेटा पापा की पापा की गोदी में नहीं जाएगा <laughs> या यहाँ जाना भैया भैया आ जाए अरे नहीं वो फो, फोटो का है आप चलोगे वहीं पोजीशन बहुत बढ़िया है यहाँ जाना लाइट में क्या करोगे लाइट में कुछ नहीं करेंगे आप बैठ जाओ करना जो है हम हम ही कर लेंगे खुद <laughs> आप बैठ के मुस्कुरा दो दो दिन बैठ के बेटा कुछ नहीं आएगा ये कैमरे हाँ इधर आओ ना इधर बैठो दो दिन बैठो दो दिन बैठो अभी बताते हैं अभी बताते हैं ये देख पापा का फोटो देखना इधर देखना ये लोकेशन हाँ 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 बताऊँ ये इधर आ मेरी गोदी में आ इधर 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 आप आप बताओ ना देख पापा कैसे बैठे हाथ लगा के मुंह कैसे बैठे वो देख हैं कैसा लग रहा है कैसा लग रहा है डॉक्टर महावीर जैन एंड माई माई ब्रदर He is my elder brother Ashan Jain, and he is my three Jain is a great guy in my life. Actually, he is a. Bike, go, bike, bike. Pregnancy of my life. He always take decisions, a great decision, and he always think uh, for my lucrative, uh, lucrative uh, future. Quick fire, Mahavir is sun or moon? Mahavir is a moon who always give light to others. And he never take back things. That's a great quality he has. बहुत बढ़िया आ रहा है. वो नीतू का ले लो इसका. वो भाग जाएगी अभी ऊपर. Partha, good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm fine. What? Ah, uh, today we have a special day where Manjul is with us. And we are there, and it's uh, wonderful to be together. Uh, and uh, your impression about? Yeah, it's not. Uh, it's not difficult to recall at all. Uh, I think I, I met him first uh, 
in the office of uh, Mr. J.D. Datta. Mm. Uh, he had called for a meeting and I saw a young person entering his door with full smile. So that picture I still uh, remember very vividly. And uh, that was the first time I saw and for a few uh, moments uh, simply I stuck to his face. Mm. During that meeting there were many other persons and almost all the persons were new to me. But gradually I think there was something which was pulling me towards him. What was that? Gradually. Yeah, there I saw, um, I was uh, uh, new to the field and the way people were talking, uh, many things I was not able to understand also. But there, I saw that how this person is uh, listening to others, how this person is responding, when he is responding, then how he is coming across. And I saw a lot of affection as well as sincerity even in that small meeting.